Fabulous Miss Perano here. Today we're going to be making a practice track for you on Astro from Fiddler's Philharmonic. This piece is not terribly difficult and it is not that fast. I think the most difficult part of this is the break and if you're not used to reading 16th notes that can be a little troublesome but if you think about it back in the day people didn't learn how to do fiddling from reading sheet music, they learned it from listening. So I, if you're having trouble with this, listen to this recording track and you'll know what this sounds like. Um, my suggestion to you is in the break to definitely make sure you're doing the ornaments because they're actually written in there. So I think they really want you to do them. Even the backup is really beautiful. Do make sure you're doing the double stops because that'll help support both the tune and the break as well. My suggestion for using this track once you know your part is to take the part you just learned, let's say it's the tune for an example, and play it against another part. So maybe that's the backup. That way it'll give you a better of understanding of how your part fits in with another part. Another thing that you can do with this track or any of the other instruments tracks as well is to play your part with another track so you know what that sounds like. You can also do this for improvisation and you can do that with this track and like maybe on the backup or any of the other tracks for the violin or the cello or bass. We're going to be going 80 beats per minute in this particular track. If you do not have a metronome at home, type in online metronome into Google. It'll come with a slidey bar adjusted to 80 and then hit play. I hope this helps violas. Ready? This is the tune. And one, two.
know if you have any questions.